Good morning, you guys. It is Sunday morning. I'm outside of Target. It is freezing here in Florida this morning. For some reason, this weekend is just extremely cold, and I'm sure we'll jump right back up to the 80s next week, but it's freezing this morning. We are gonna run inside. We definitely have some good deals at Target this week. We have a spend 40, get 10 on tons of personal care products. We have some good digital coupons to work with. Before we jump into all the deals though, I just wanted to chat really quickly. I mentioned this at the beginning of my Publix video, but I wanted to fill you guys in as well because I know not all of you watch my Publix videos. I have been going through some health issues myself, my family. We just had a lot going on the last couple weeks. I got diagnosed with Hashimoto's. My son went through a bunch of allergy testing. He's actually gonna have to go in and get shots every week to try to get that under control. So we're just really working on our health and our diet. So I'm gonna be making a few changes. It's not really gonna affect my videos that much, but we're trying to eat a lot healthier. And I'm also trying to minimize my own stress and save myself some time and all of that. So with my hauls, I would previously try to put together the best deals and try to give you guys an idea. If you bought all of these items, you could get to $2 out of pocket or free or money maker, but I'm not really gonna be striving for that super impressive haul anymore. I'm gonna be picking up items that my family will actually use, maybe a few items that I can sell or donate, but mostly just things that we actually want in our home. So that might not lead to super impressive hauls, but that's what I'm gonna be doing. I will still share all of the amazing deals, all the freebies, all the money makers, all of that with you guys. I'm also gonna be adding in some healthier food options because that's what I'm looking for. And I know a lot of you over the last week on Instagram and YouTube have been sharing with me that that's really important to you too. And you don't see enough couponing deals on actual perishable grocery items. Now there's not a ton of them to be honest, but when there are some good deals, I definitely wanna share them. Sometimes I don't share some of those grocery and perishable deals because they're not super impressive. It's not anything over 50% savings or anything like that but we all know any savings on those healthier perishable items is amazing so I'm going to be showing more of those types of deals and I'm thinking about putting together a separate video that I post maybe on Mondays or Tuesdays where I go to Walmart and I share any type of couponing savings you can get on grocery items I feel like it kind of deserves its own video instead of cramming it all in with tons of I bought a rebates and personal care items and everything I think that would be too much so I might come out with a separate video for some grocery deals every week. All right, with all that being said, let's jump in store. Let's check out some of the hottest deals this week at Target. We are gonna start working on our spend 40 get 10 promotion. This is a gift card promotion you need to clip in the app. It is a category coupon. I learned the hard way today that it cannot be combined if you have another category coupon like spend 120, get $20 off for your entire purchase. You can only have one category coupon apply per item. So for example, if I pick up this Neutrogena eyeliner, it can't count towards both of those promotions. You'd have to pick one or the other. You can do the spend 40, get 10 multiple times. You just have to do it in separate transactions. So let's look at a couple different options you can put in a scenario. You could either grab a Neutrogena eyeliner or a mascara. These here are $7.59. You might have a $2.50 digital. If you go to your wallet and look at all of your clipped digitals, you might have it in there. It's not available to clip anymore, but you might also have an offer over on the coupons.com app that you can still use. You can also submit it over to Ibotta for $3 back on one. Another Neutrogena option is this makeup removing balm for $9.99. You might have a $3 digital or submit to the coupons.com app for $3 and then there's also a $4 Ibotta rebate. There is also a $1 Ibotta bonus if you haven't done it yet if you pick up one of the eyeliners and one of the makeup remover balms. To my knowledge, the BOGO Cetaphil coupons are still not scanning at Target. I tried it a few days ago, but if you still wanted to grab some Cetaphil wipes for $6.99, you could use a $4 coupon. Those are scanning at Target. You can either get those from signing up on the Cetaphil website, or you might have got one in an email from Cetaphil recently. If you have not signed up for Cetaphil yet, I'll have a link down below to sign up. We got new Tresemme coupons in the Unilever insert that came out today on the 13th. We did get four off of two coupons for Tresemme stylers. Those coupons work on these hairsprays here for $3.59. So if you wanted to pick up two of those and use a four off of two coupon, that's a pretty good option to throw into your spend 40, get 10. 
My store is still out of stock of the Nivea Sensitive and Radiant Lotion for $5.79. We still have a $2 Ibotta rebate, and we have a $4.50 off of two coupon from Save36, or you could print a $2 coupon from coupons.com or submit to the coupons.com app. We got a Dove BOGO hand soap coupon in our 313 Unilever, so you could definitely pick up two of these Dove hand soaps and put that in your spend 40 get 10 scenario. I did use the BOGO coupon today and it did scan at checkout, which is awesome. It's not gonna take off the full value of the product because it's gonna factor in the gift card value into the value of the products. So the BOGO coupon will probably take off about $3. We have $4 coupons for the Dove shower butter or the cleanser, both are $7.99. We have two separate $4 digital coupons, but then we also have $4 coupons in the 313 Unilever. We have a dollar digital coupon for the Edge Shave Gel, and we also have a dollar Ibotta rebate, so you could pick these up for $2.99, pay just $0.99 cents after the digital and Ibotta, and that's a really easy one to throw in your scenario to knock out an Ibotta rebate. You could pick up one of these Chic Hydro men's razors for $11.89. We have a $5 digital. You can also submit to the coupons.com app for $5. We also have a $3 Ibotta rebate. There's also some separate Ibotta rebates for the razor refills. If you wanted to pick up one razor and then one refill pack, use the $5 digital and then submit to the coupons.com app for the other one. Another razor option is this six blade Dollar Shave Club starter kit for $9.99. There's a $2.50 digital coupon. We also have a $2.50 coupon in the 313 Unilever. You can submit this also to Checkout 51 for $2. It's an even better deal to grab the six blade refills for $9.99. We have those $2.50 coupons, then submit to checkout 51 for $2.50. And I also have a fetch offer for $2 back on one. So here's one scenario that's all digital. If you pair these four items together, submit to the rebates and use the digital coupons that I mentioned. After the $10 gift card, everything is gonna be $3.56 or about 89 cents each. Now this total, if your prices are exactly like mine, is a little bit under 40, but I added everything to my cart online and it did prompt for the gift card. So you can always try that online to see if you're gonna hit that dollar amount to get the gift card at checkout. This is the scenario that I decided to do today. I'm using the Dove BOGO coupon and then also one of the Dollar Shave Club coupons. Everything else is digital. After the $10 gift card, all of this is gonna end up costing me $9.64 or $1.61 each. I'm excited that we finally have some good deals on the Airwick refills since a lot of us have so many plugs. We did get a BOGO insert coupon and if you pick up two of these for $4.99, it would take off $4.99. But on the coupons.com website and on the app, we have a $6.50 off of two, which is definitely gonna be a better value in this case. Also on the Target app, there is a digital coupon for $3.25 off of one. So if you wanted to just pick up one of these for $4.99 and use the digital, it would be $1.74. But if you wanted to pick up two, you could definitely submit to the coupons.com app for $6.50 off of two if you wanted to do it that way. You could definitely pick up three and use the digital and submit to the coupons.com app. We have an awesome deal on the Microban Cleaner Sprays. These are $3.99. We have two different dollar digital coupons. One's a store coupon, one is a manufacturer coupon. So you can clip both in the app and both will come off. You can also scan and submit to Shopkick for $1.70, making one of these just 29 cents. We do have a laundry gift card promotion this week. Buy three, get a $10 gift card. I wasn't super excited about any scenarios, but we do have a $3 digital coupon for Persil. Also, if you got that 20 off of 120 or 10 off of 60, you could definitely stack that with this gift card promotion since it doesn't need to be clipped in the app. It's not a category coupon, so you could stack those in that situation. If you can find this Tylenol PM 24 count in your store, it's $5.19 and it's buy two, get a $5 gift card this week. There is a $2 digital coupon. You could also submit to the coupons.com app for $2. We also have a $2 insert coupon from Save227. So after the gift card and two $2 coupons, you're gonna pay $1.38 or 69 cents each. We have some pretty good deals on the Natrol products this week because they're buy two, get a $5 gift card. We just got these $2 coupons from the Smart Source 313, and you can use two in one transaction. So if you pick up two of the products for $7.19, after the gift card and the coupons, you'll pay $5.38 or $2.69 each. 
The Pure Z's products by VIX are buy two, get a $5 gift card this week as well. The kids product here for $7.99 attaches to a $2 Ibotta rebate, so I wanted to pick this one up, but I didn't realize it's actually on clearance. When I brought it over to the register, it did ring up a clearance price, and so that's not going to prompt for the gift card, so just be careful of that. But this product here for $7.99 attaches to a $2 Ibotta rebate, will work with the $1.50 coupon we have from the March PG. We also have a $1.50 digital coupon, and then you'll get that $5 gift card for buying two. So it makes two of them $3.98 or $1.99 each. We also have a pretty good deal on this Zarbi's Children's Melatonin Tablets for $6.99. They're buy two, get five, and we do have a $2 digital coupon. I couldn't find any other paper coupons or offers on the coupons.com app that seemed like they would work because when I scanned it into the coupons.com app, it didn't come up for the four off of two or the $2 Zarbi's coupons. So I'm wondering if just this specific one for $6.99 doesn't qualify for those options. But in addition to the $2 digital coupon, there's also a $2 store coupon you can clip on the Target app. So that will give you a total of $4 off. So after those coupons and the $5 gift card for buying two, you'll pay $4.98 for two. I found some awesome Advil clearance I wanted to share. So this one here on clearance for $2.79 will work with this $1.50 coupon from Save220. This Advil PM here will work with this $2 coupon from Save36. So that makes it just $1.05, normally over $10. I found some boost on clearance for $4.49 a pack. We have these four off of two coupons from Smart Source 130. There's also a $2 Ibotta rebate that attaches to these. So if you can find two of these packs after Ibotta and the coupon, it comes to 98 cents for two packs. If you have the 50% off specialty cheese Target Circle offer, it attaches to this Gouda here, the Jarlsberg, and then also this spicy pepper jack. There's a few others, but in my store, those were some of the ones that you could grab. You're gonna get 50% off of each one and up to four items in one transaction. Here is your reminder to always check the Target meat section. Look for these coupons on the meat. It means they just have a few days left until they expire, but you can either use them right away or freeze them for later. If you see these coupons, you're gonna wanna scan the main barcode first and then scan the coupon barcode second. It works exactly like any other coupon we have. A few days ago, I found some grass-fed ground beef in a Target with $3 coupons on them, making each one about $4 a pack which was awesome. So you always want to check. I get some of my best meat deals at Target. We have a pretty great deal on Velveeta with the $1.50 off of two coupon we just got in the Smart Source 313. You can pick up two of these at Target for $3.59. Use that $1.50 coupon. You can submit to Ibotta for $0.75 cents back on each. And there's also an offer on Checkout 51 for a dollar back on two. So it makes two boxes $3.18 or $1.59 each, which I think is a pretty great price for these. All of those rebates though are available at other stores. So if you wanted to pick some up at Walmart, you could definitely do that. The Ragu Swagbucks deal is even better now because we just got 50 cent coupons in the Save 313. So I'm going to grab two of them and use two 50 cent coupons, submit to Swagbucks for $2 back on two, making two of them 58 cents or just 29 cents a jar. We have a Target Circle offer for 20% off Back to the Roots products, and you could pair that with this BOGO coupon here. I found this on the seed display in store. These bags of potting mix are $6.99, so if you pick up two of them, use a BOGO coupon, and then use that 20% off Circle offer, you'll pay $5.59 or $2.80 per bag. There are also a lot of kits for around $12.99. We have a bunch of different $5 Ibotta rebates that attach to these. So if you wanted to pick up one of these, I'm gonna grab this microgreens kit. So after Ibotta and the 20% off, it'll come to $5.83. So this is everything that I picked up at Target today. There was a couple items I threw in. I was trying to get to the spend 120, get $20 off. So I threw in a couple items that we needed and some really great clearance finds. So I shared with you guys the Boost. That is an amazing deal. Also the Advil PM I ended up picking up. These little bandages were half off. I think they were like $3 and my son is going to love these. How cute are those? I also picked up this. This was half off on clearance. It's a tummy relief and my son's been struggling with that. So I thought that might be something to try. 
I found these Cliff Bars on clearance for my husband. So these were normally $10 a box because it's the minis, but it's a 10 count. And they were on clearance for just $4.49 or $4.99, something like that. So that was an awesome deal. I definitely wanted to grab those for him. And I also grabbed a big thing of chalk for $6 because it is getting warmer and we have spring break. So I thought that would be perfect to snag. So like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, I learned the hard way that you can't stack the spend 120, get 20 with the spend 40, get 10 because you have to clip both of them in the app. They're both category coupons. Another issue I ran into was the Pure Z's. So both of these items, the kids and the regular one, work with the coupon, work with Ibotta. They are part of the buy two, get five, but this kids one was on clearance. It was like $1.50 or something so it didn't work for the gift card promotion and I didn't realize till afterwards that I did not get that five dollars so just keep an eye on clearance it's really a pain to think about it but you might want to scan things before you even get to the register you know how they have those little red scan boxes just to make sure nothing you're using for a gift card promotion is on clearance because then it won't work for the gift card promotion but I think I shared a lot of really great options for you guys for the spend 40 get 10. A lot of great clearance finds and I also definitely need to mention none of my coupons gave me issues today. So we had the boost, I had a 250 for Dollar Shave Club, I used the Advil PM, the BOGO Dove, no issues there. I used one of the Pure Z's coupon, the other was digital, that went through, the two Ragu coupons went through, so no issues with paper coupons today, which is awesome. For all of those items there, I paid 106, but you see I got the $20 off plus my red card, and then my manufacturer coupon payment down there was $14.31. I'm gonna be submitting over to Shopkick for the micro band, that was the only thing on Shopkick. Over on Fetch, I'm gonna get $2 for the blades, that was the only thing over on Fetch. Over on Swagbucks, we have the $2 back for buying the two ragu, so no issues there. Over on Checkout 51, we're going to get $2 for the razor and then $2.50 for the refill. Over on the coupons.com app, we are going to be submitting for a few things over there. So $6.50 for the two Airwick. I realized at the register that I had the $3.25 clipped for one. And if I kept that clipped, then it would have taken that off and I couldn't submit to the coupons.com app because it's only $6.50 back on two and I would only have one available to use a coupon on. So while I was checking out, I unclipped it and then it did take it off. So that was nice. So I'll submit both of these for $6.50 on the coupons.com app. Also $2.50 for the Neutrogena. I think that's it. Everything else is over on Ibotta. So we got $2 for each of the Boost, $3 for the Neutrogena Eye. We're going to get $2 for each of the Pure Z's, $5 for the Microgreens Kit. I didn't hit any bonuses or anything with this haul today, but taking into consideration, I didn't get those two gift cards I was expecting because I made those mistakes. Everything here still ended up costing me about $33 when it was normally over $120. <laughs> so that is pretty awesome. Lots of great items for my family. And like I mentioned, I'm really trying to only grab the items that I see a real need for in my household or if it's gonna be something easy to donate or sell. I'm just trying to cut back on having huge piles of things in my home that then I feel pressured to donate or sell all the time. And it's just a lot of added stress that I'm trying to cut back on right now. So definitely happy with this. There's a lot of great deals and a lot of great clearance. So in the Google doc down below, I'll have all the deals I mentioned, but I'll also list out some of the clearance finds just so that you have it fresh in your mind when you're running to the store. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel if you have not yet, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.